Greetings and welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to our Let's Play Dragon Age 2. As always, I'm Dungeon Master 201, and uh, we're going to be doing enemies amongst us. Hopefully we can do this. First of all, I need to go ahead and... Uh... Up is a belly here. Again, we always gotta make sure that... No. We need to give her some willpower. All right, let's do this. Another corpse. At least this time my uh, inventory has been cleared out, so we don't have too much to worry about. Wait a minute, is there a corpse up there? Yes, there is. So I can go and collect as much as I want at this point. And trust they be my witness, Wilmot. I will have the truth from you now. Mercy, sir. Mercy. Were it that easy. Don't hit me. I will know where you're going, and I will know now. Don't you lay another hand on that boy. This is Templar business, stranger. <laughs> You have struck me the last time, you pathetic human! To me! Make her preserve us! involved in something sinister but this is it even possible do you think he was possessed normally we only worry that mages will fall victim to possession i have heard of blood mages or demons in solid form who could summon others into unwilling hosts i had not thought one of our own would be susceptible You shouldn't have been out here alone with him. I am Knight Captain Cullen. I thank you for your assistance. Cullen! I've been I thought he went insane! Some of our recruits who have gone missing. Wilmot was the first to return. I had hoped to confront him quietly, out of sight. I was trying to find another recruit, a friend of Wilmot's. Do you know where Karen is? He also disappeared. They were last seen together at the Blooming Rose. But I had no luck interrogating the, uh, young ladies there. I doubt they know anything of magic or demons. I'll speak with them. You never know how much you can learn from pillow talk. The order would truly be in your debt if you helped us with this. No one at the brothel will speak with me for fear I would shut them down for serving our recruits. If you learn what manner of creature did this to Wilmot, please come tell me in the gallows. I will ensure you are rewarded. And looks like we're going to need to go this way. This place can be like a confusing maze sometimes. something honey a couple of Templar recruits went missing they were last seen here you'll have to be more specific we do a lot of business with the Templars we have a lot of missing Templars if we don't act quickly we may only find corpses now now no need to get all dramatic on me 
Let me look through the books. Wilmud, Karen. Here we go. Wilmud came in here a lot. You sure he had time to be a Templar? The both of them last saw Iduna, the exotic wonder from the east. That's quite the stage name. It sounds better than the tramp from Darktown. <laughs> you should hear what some of the others are called. Is there anything else you can tell me? Honey, I could write volumes on the things I know. Unless you want Wilma's favorite position, I think you have what you need. You didn't hear any of this from me. We clear? Yep. We are clear on that. And it looks like they're in here. Iduna, right? Do you remember entertaining a Templar named Wilmot a few weeks ago? Or Karen? Wilmot. Wilmot. That doesn't sound familiar. I know he saw you frequently. With a body like mine, men rarely have time to give me their names. They're too busy doing other things. Questions are boring. Why don't we have some real fun? Hawk, go easy on this lovely creature. You should listen to your friend. We have to ask her about Karen. What's your problem? Yes, yes. But certainly there's no harm mixing a little business and pleasure. I'm here on business. Karen. Wilmot. Answer one of my questions first. Who told you about little old me? It was Vivica. She showed me her books. That wasn't so hard, was it? So, Vivica sold me out, did she? That drab, pathetic little sewer rat. She will be dealt with. Just do one more thing for me. Draw your blade and bring it gently across your throat. God damn it. I will not obey you. What are you doing? Stop that. Stop that now. What? How did she do that? Bleeding ancestors, I feel like a fool. Blood magic. It must be. Maybe we can find answers somewhere around here. And then a cold shower. State prostitutes? A prostitute! <laughs> friends make their home in the Undercity. Shall we pay them a visit? A prostitutes! I like that! No one worry about the dead corpse. I'm sure it'll eventually smell when you guys figure it out. Uh, back to... Dark Town. I think they're the same thing. Yeah. Doesn't matter on that one. Alright, let's see what... Hey, there we go.
Yep. I like it. And we got a crafting recipe. Oh, it's just a recipe. And a resource. Good. I think you've got enough. Yeah, I know. Thanks. We'll do that once we know there are no more quests to do. Make sure that we get everything good, good, good. Someone's left a surprise here for us. Have you ever been out in the open ocean in a storm? Best feeling in the world. Wonderful. More vessels for our experiments. Where is Karen? Perhaps the demons will find one of you suitable. Always the demon thing. Can't you people say no? I am not some hopeless waif that ran crying to a demon. I sought them out and embraced them. Let's see. Um... Try to give me to your demons. Good, good. The demons like spirit. If a few more Templars fall to the demons, we can seed chaos in their ranks. How many abominations can they discover amongst their own before it drives the Knight Commander crazy? Let's see. Um... You're worse than a monster. Goodbye. Kill the vessels only if you must. Oh, bullshit! Stupid immortality! Is it over? Karen. Yes. That's my name. Oh, thank the Maker. I thought he had abandoned me. But is it only Karen? It could be Karen plus one. A very nasty plus one at that. The cage has opened. Thank Andraste. Any chance you can tell if Karen has an 
extra passenger. Well, there's one sure way. Uh, what, what was that about? If there was a demon in there, it would have defended itself. Looks like he's clear. Go ahead and leave, Karen. You've been through enough. Don't tell the Templars. I... I don't know what they do to me. Please. I need to go back. Tell them I'm all right. Tell my sister. I... I must go. When you talk to Sir Cullen, maybe downplay the blood magic angle. We don't need the Templars cracking down even harder. Good. Let's get out of here. No, we gotta go back and let them know about this. I really hope that we're almost done with this act. Blood mages have infiltrated your ranks. They've been implanting your recruits with demons. Sweet blood of Andraste. Demons? Did you say something about the recruits and demons? I didn't want to tell you, Masha. They... they were horrible. Those mages see the rest of us as ants to be crushed. They won't stop until they've destroyed the Chantry and the Templars forever. Not all mages are like that. True. Not every mage gives in to temptation, but none are ever free of it. At any time, any mage could become a monster. From the lowest apprentice to the most seasoned enchanters. Mages cannot be treated like people. They are not like you and me. Surely that's a little harsh. They are weapons. They have the power to light a city on fire in a fit of pique. There's fault on both sides. We must find a way to live in peace. Perhaps you're right. Perhaps mages need better education as to why the Chantry functions as it does. Perhaps they would not go against the will of Andraste herself. I will look into it. For now, Karen, unless it is proven you are free of demons, I must strip you of your commission immediately. No, you can't really think that. Karen's fine. He's safe. Please, sir. I tried to resist. I never took anything they offered. I... I need this position, or my sister can't eat. I've been training for five years. We conducted tests on Karen. He's not possessed. He can stay in the Order. I hesitate to ask what methods you used that you are so certain. Still, you have done much for us by stopping these blood mages. I will heed your request. If he has shown no sign of demonic possession in ten years' time, Karen will become eligible for full knighthood. Thank you, Sarah. Again. But without a full knighthood, Karen's pay is so small. I do not know if I can reward you as you deserve. I will handle that, miss. You have done the Order a great service. We will not forget it. God damn. That is one hell of a probationary period. Ten years? Whew! All right, what is that? Okay, that's the Deep Roads Expedition. Let's go ahead and see what this is about. I really hate having to run around the whole goddamn city. Such a pain in the ass. <laughs> well. That was unexpected. Looks like the only thing we have left to do is the Deep Roads Expedition, except that we have a letter. Let's see what this letter is. Hopefully we can finally get close to doing the uh, the final one.
Let's see. Let's see. guess we got something else. Yeah, I think this is just the bullshit thing. We'll go check it out. Even though it won't go for it. At this point, if you don't have 50, uh, coin, I personally would not go with it. I would just use the, uh, the special cheat way. Well, well. Now it's beginning to all make sense. Do I know you? I know him. I thought Bartrand told you to clear off Doodle. Calm yourself, Varric. I just wanted to meet your brother's new business partner. And just how do you know about that? Let's just say that Bartrand and I have had dealings in the past. Dougal's one of my dear brother's ex-partners. Bartrand turned aside my offer of help, even though I had the coin to spare. Thing is, I still think it's a promising venture. The fool won't let me invest, but... If someone like you invested on my behalf... What do you think? Hard to say. Dougal's never done me any harm. See? There you go. Still don't trust you. You're as sour a bastard as my brother without the family connection to make it easier to swallow. Do what you like. I came to you, not to him. But we do need the coin. If Bartrand doesn't want your help, neither do I. Think you can come up with a coin all on your own, eh? Fair enough. My sister always has something up her sleeve. She's better. You change your mind? Come talk to me. I doubt this expedition is going anywhere in the meantime. Okay. That is kind of pointless. We already have the coin needed, so... Yeah, there are better ways to get the coin if you don't have it at this point. Just use the, uh, the cheat, uh... Duplication money glitch and you'll be perfectly fine. And we'll go ahead and do that. Give him that. Confirm. We're going to go back to Gamelin here. We're going to uh, switch party members. I know who I want to bring along for this. And if you guys liked, be sure to like, comment, and if you're new, subscribe. And next time, we're going to be bringing this act to an end. This has been Dungeon Master 201, signing out.